So here's how you find equivalent fractions for 3 fifths or 3 over 5. What we're trying to do is find the same value for 3 fifths, but have a different numerator and denominator. So we could multiply 3 fifths by 1. That wouldn't change anything. But instead of 1, let's use 2 over 2. Because 2 divided by 2 is 1. We're multiplying by 1. Doesn't change the value. So 2 times 3 is 6. 2 times 5 is 10. So 6 tenths, that's the equivalent fraction to 3 fifths. If you divide 3 by 5 or 6 by 10, you get 0 0.6. 3 fifths and 6 tenths are equivalent fractions. Let's try another one. Let's multiply by 3 over 3. Again, 3 over 3, that equals 1. So we're just multiplying by 1. Now, 3 times 3 is 9. 3 times 5, that's 15. And again, we have another equivalent fraction for 3 fifths. Divide 9 by 15, 0 0.6. One more, let's do seven over seven. Again, since seven over seven is one, we haven't changed the actual value. It's still 0.6, but we have an equivalent fraction for three fifths. This is Dr. B with several equivalent fractions for three fifths. Thanks for watching.